I don't know if Mark for Death will work on this dra on the dragons. Again, that's not gonna work because I just pissed off the solitude guard. I didn't think about that. That's a bad thing. Hello and welcome. My name is Ty. I'm the gaming gearhead, and this is my playthrough of Skyrim on Survival Legendary difficulty. This time we're gonna find uh, that helmet for that guy that was waiting outside of the inn. What was his name? Noster. Find Noster's helmet in Steepfall Barrow. So we're gonna head on over to Steepfall Barrow and see if we can get this guy's helmet back. Before I go, I went ahead and upgraded all of my armor because he finally had some uh, moonstone. The it's all a little bit better now. Superior, it says. It's superior armor. All right, now that the armor is a little more stout. Now we're gonna go over and find that guy's helmet. Kind of heading farther into the wilderness from where we were last time, because last time we were at Wolf Skull Cave. I don't remember how. I, th I don't remember if you have to go around the backside along the shore. I don't remember if you go this way and through here. I guess we'll find out on the way. We'll just wing it. What's the worst that could happen? Out the way. I'm going on an adventure. I hear a bear. I'm on a horse, though. Is this where I need to go? This is where I need to go. This is the entryway. That dang old bear over here. And a wi- uh, not a wisp, a wraith. Dang old bear and a wraith. wonder if I can lure them to fight each other. Or are they just both gonna chase me? Both gonna chase me? Why am I stuck? <laughs> Let's see how good I can fight from the horseback. <laughs> Probably not that good. Are they fighting each other? Yes! That's what I wanted. Okay. They buys me a second. We'll just invite Ghost Guy and some Oak Flesh. Horse, don't go getting yourself killed. Let's do it. Mocked for death. No, not the horse. Ah, oh, that did not go my way at all. <laughs> he hit me twice and I'm down. Round two. Fight! Alright, where are you at? Ice Wraith. Come this way. Yeah, let them fight each other. Janessa, it'd be nice if you'd show up. Alright, horse guy. You stay here. This time I'm gonna stay back. If only for a minute, because I only have nine arrows. Did I just hit the wraith? This guy, I wish you would stop getting between us. He, like, gets directly between us. Here comes Janessa. Okay. Over your left shoulder, Janessa. Am I out of arrows already? Apparently so. Axe it is. Here, I'll take the backside. He's almost down. Yes! Got two of my arrows back. My horse didn't get involved. Janessa showed up. That was a good little fight. 
Down the bloody trail. That's not concerning at all. Another bear. Janessa. Is he chasing me? I think so. I was hearing an echo of my own footsteps or something. My horse's footsteps. It sounded like he was right on my tail. Bear guy. I can take the storm cloak cloak and add more warmth to myself. I suppose that's beneficial. Is that cheating on survival? It's technically an add-on. Because it's from a the mod. Also requires me to be wearing their insignia, and I don't know if I like that. I'll leave it off. Skyrim belongs to the Nords. I'm not really a storm cloak type of person, though. I'm not really imper imperial, either. I'm just kind of... It's kind of here. There's the entrance. Hidden away. Sorry, horse. You gotta stay out here. Ooh, blood everywhere. Alright, so let's sneak it around and see what we can find. I don't actually remember... I know I've done this quest at some point, but I don't remember which one it is. Is that a troll? Looks like a troll. Snake attack. I sense a presence. Oh, he moved. <laughs> Come at us, bro. I'll just stay back here. Go get him, guys. <laughs> hey, really, I could just foos for dough him right off this ledge, I suppose. Can't get through, you guys are in the way. You know what? Come on, unrelenting force. What am I looking for? I don't wanna I don't wanna hit Janessa off. You can never truly stop. Bye! <laughs> that works. Easy peasy. Anything up here I missed? No? Okay. Let's keep going, Janessa. Further ahead we go. That's a long way down. Careful. Our footsteps will echo in every chamber and tunnel. Could be bad. We don't want to lure uh, more trolls. To which it sounds like there may be more trolls ahead. Pretty sure I just heard one. Yep. Not unrelenting forcing him. Do I have any poisons? One weak lingering poison and one stamina poison. And these to me are almost kind of useless. We'll use that though. Batter up! And out. Nope, now I'm trapped. This hallway ain't big enough for the three of us. Four if you count the ghost guy. I got him though. Pretty sure I smacked Janessa there at the end. <laughs> Sorry, Janessa. Was that it? Just this? Was this all the quest was? No. 
It just seems like nothing. Found another dead guy. With a sword. And a book. Mystery of Talara. <gasps> Destruction increased. Better never use it. Dwarven shield. I'll take the sword and seal shield. Some gold. Great sword. What's in the chest? Noster's helmet. Soul gem. And some other miscellaneous stuff. <gasps> Prices are better. 20% better. Well, that was quick and easy. Alright, well, I guess let's get out of here. I like how you can see the glow of the statue of Meridia in the background there. Oop, missed my turn almost. This doesn't concern you, citizen. You know, we've already been over this with you guys once. You really want to go there now? Dang old Thalmor. Like, where do you guys think I got the armor I'm wearing? I'm actually kind of surprised that they didn't just attack me on sight. Like, shouldn't they know that I'm the person that caused all that chaos in their embassy just a few minutes ago? Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. I have no business with you. Leave me. I wasn't talking to you. By blade or Rude by ass. spell. If you want hey, to death, I'll make it. Death. Divines bless you. May the ground you walk quake as you pass. It does. Look at I found it. your helmet. That's real Nord craftsmanship, that is. Let me show you an old trick I learned as a scout. Makes it harder for the enemy to notice you. <gasps> Thanks. It's best you leave me be. You bet. Appreciate it. Have a nice day. You should probably be in bed. You're looking a bit under the weather. So you are you telling me that I'm veteran. ugly? You stay out of trouble now. The cast time is it? 9 p.m. Dungeon can break even the strongest will. Guess we're gonna get some sleep, and then figure out what we're gonna do from here. Cause that was a short mission. I was expecting it to be way longer than that. Welcome to the wing. Are you joking? You just rented a room for me. Apparently, I still have the room access to the room. We'll drive. All right, well, now i got to figure out what uh, I'm going to do from here. You know, I guess we'll investigate the man wandering the streets near the Bard's College. Because I know what that quest is. And it's kind of short, too, but I kind of enjoy it. Let's go see what kind of trouble we can get in. Hello, sir. Do you have a minute? You, you help me. You help people, right? That's what you do. I try. What do you need? My master has abandoned me. Abandoned his people. And nothing I say can change his mind. Now he refuses to even see me. He says I interrupt his vacation. It's been so many years. Won't you please help? Why don't you leave your master? I don't remember if I've ever asked that. Oh, you just don't understand. Without him, I am not free. Without him, I am doomed. All of his empire shall fall into chaos. Chaos. How can I find your master? Last I saw him, he was visiting a friend in the Blue Palace. But no one as mundane as the Jarl. No, no. Such people are below him. No, Peasants. he went into the forbidden wing of the palace to speak with an old friend. Said it had been ages since they had last had tea. Oh, and you'll need the hip bone. It's very important. No entering Pelagius's wing without that. The hip bone. So you need me to bring him back. Yes, but don't try to use force. He's far too mighty. He'd crush you like a clay doll or drop you from the sky or simply <laughs> eat your brain right up. You shouldn't have oh, done that. <laughs> but he probably won't do those things to you. Probably. Just remind him to come home and there'll be no fighting or unpleasantness. Probably. Probably. He's just a little confused at the moment, is all. And crazy. Knowing my master, he may very well reward you for bringing him to his senses. Why do you need him back? Without his guidance, our homeland is falling apart. North wages war against South. The holy flame flickers and dies. We need his return. Oh, but I'm sure he'll repay you when he comes to his senses. His favor is a powerful, powerful thing. And so very worth any inconveniences. Who is your master? 
He is a great man, but one rarely praised. He rules twin empires that span the length and breadth of our minds. All know him, but few can name him. But he has forbidden me from saying his name. He says it distracts him, and woe to those who draw his ire. But you will know him when you see him. He's the one who made me like this. Does it rhyme with Way of Shorgath? All right, here, have a piece of gold. Oh, thank you. Divines, bless your kind heart. Until next time. Until next time. So I apparently need to go to the Blue Palace and try and get into the Pelagius' wing. Pelagius' wing. Pelagius's? Plagii. I don't know what the proper phrasing for that would be. But we're at the Blue Palace again. Who do I need to talk to? Who are to you? Watch what you're doing. Falk again. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. I need to get into the Pelagius wing. Absolutely not. Why not? That wing has been sealed for hundreds of years. And for good reason. They say the ghost of Pelagius the Mad still haunts it. Ghost Sounds or neat. not, there are reminders of his dark rule. When she called Ghostbusters. Buried away. Da -da 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 -da. Falk, you know, be I'll careful. Make an exception for you, but do not bring anything out when you leave. Too many dark deeds transpired in those halls. That was kind of too easy. Anyone with a actually. stout heart like yours is welcome here. Hey, thanks. Don't worry, I won't break anything. Okay, where are we is? Wow, you guys really need a dust in here. A little lacking on the uh, cobweb cleaning. And I'm randomly naked. That was weird. Oh, I couldn't. Goes right through me. Besides, All right. I have so many things to do. So many undesirables to contend with. Naysayers, buffoons, detractors. Why, my, my headsman hasn't slept in three days. You are far too hard on yourself, my dear, sweet, homicidally insane Pelagius. What would the people do without you? Dance, sing, smile, <laughs> grow old. You are the best septum that's ever ruled. Well, except for that Martin fella. But he turned into a dragon god, and that's hardly sporting. You know, I was there for that whole sordid affair. Marvelous time! Butterflies, blood, a fox, a severed head, ho oh, ho ho, and the cheese! To die for. I love cheese. Yes, yes, as you've said countless times before. Harumph! Well then, if you're going to be like that, Perhaps it's best I take my leave. A good day to you, sir. I said good day! Good day! Yes, yes, go. Leave me to my ceaseless responsibilities and burdens. Goodbye. Why can't I teleport around like that? You there! How rude! Can't be bothered to host an old friend for a decade or two. Sure. Um... I'm here to deliver a message. Really? Really. Oh, oh, what kind of message? A song? A summons? Wait, uh, I know. A death threat written on the back of an Argonian concubine. Ah, those are my favorites. Did that happen? Well, spit it out, mortal. I haven't got an eternity. I'm not just mortal. I'm Dragonborn. Actually, I do. Little joke. But seriously, what's the message? <laughs> I think I made a mistake coming here. Oh, no, 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 no mistake at all. What you made was a choice. Granted, not a very wise choice, but... I make a lot of things. dumb choices. <laughs> oh, the folly of youth. You know, you remind me of myself at a young age. All I cared about was riding narwhals and sleeping in honeycombs and drinking baby's tears. That's weird. Word of advice. If you ride a narwhal... Mind the pointy end. Yeah, I'll keep that in mind ah, if it ever comes up. Ah, but there I go. Waxing poetic about me misspent youth. 
Now, where were we? <laughs> yes. I don't know. You tell you're me. You're the mortal messenger. And I am? Honestly, have you any idea? I mean, it says your name right there. But, uh, sure, I'm afraid not. Wrong! Actually, you do, sort of. I am a part of you, little mortal. I'm a shadow in your subconscious. A blemish on your fragile little psyche. You know me. You just don't know it. Sheagorath, Daedric Prince of Madness, at your service. <laughs> so does that mean you'll leave or not? Now that's the real question, isn't it? Because honestly, how much time off could a demented Daedra really need? So, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave. That's right, I'm done. Holiday! I complete. did it. Time to return to the humdrum day to day. On one condition. You have to find the way out first. Well, good luck with that. What's the catch? Ha! I do love it when the mortals know they're being manipulated. Makes things infinitely more interesting. Care to take a look around? This is not, I dare say, the Solitude Botanical Gardens. Have you any idea where you are? Where you truly are? Welcome to the deceptively verdant mind of the Emperor Pelagius III. That's right! You're in the head of a dead, homicidally insane monarch! <laughs> <laughs> now, nice place here. I know what you're thinking. Can I still rely on my swords and spells and sneaking and all that nonsense? Sure. Sure. Or you could use... The Wabajack! The Wabajack. Huh? huh? Didn't see that coming, did you? I mean, since I've done this before, yes. But no, I'll humor you. Is it equipped? It is. Okay. Let's get to Wabajackin. Up first. You have headed down the path of dreams. Oh, the dreams. Unfortunately for you, Pelagius suffered night terrors from a young age. All you need to do is find something to wake our poor Pelagius up. You'll find his terrors easy to repel, but persistent. Just blast him with the Wabajack. Blast the night terrors. I missed. Again and again. Oh, you can actually do damage to me, huh? Why am I missing? You're right in front of me. Gotcha. Why does it want me to stand right here? Does it not? Okay. Blast it again. Picked a bad time to get lost, friend. Never should have come here. How am I not making contacts? What happens if I yes. zap the kid? Nothing. Zap him again. <gasps> Dang old hag raven. Yeah, yeah. If I blast the lady. Nothing. What are you doing, kid? He's like over here dancing, acting all crazy. Now that's a threat. Got him, though. Or her. Or they. What's next? I don't remember fighting a dragon priest. He uh, slapped me in the face. Ah! Zap me in the face. I didn't think they could do, do actual damage to me here. Clearly, I was wrong. Wakey, wakey. No, not wakey, wakey. Get out of here. Get out of here. Bad doggy. 
Rise and shine. It's time for school. You picked a bad time to get lost, friend. I ain't your friend, pal. You need something? I ain't your pal, buddy. Freaking hag raven. I ain't gonna lie. She don't look like a nightmare. Okay. Yeah. Be distracted by the goat. Is that the last one that I remember? Helps if I hit the car target. Oh yeah. Wow, that was terrible. No. Well, now that's something to grow about. With Pelagius up and about, you're moving right along. We'll both Am be I? home in no time. Yeah, sure. It's actually been a few days since <laughs> I started this because I had to pause and go do something else and just came back. Hey, you! You're finally awake. Why does it sound like there's two different competing audio tracks happening at the same time? There are. I see you've been minding your own business. So, how's the mind? He'll sleep peacefully now. Ah, good. Good. No more barking at all hours and chewing up the slippers. That good idea. Ah. Um, we're not talking about barks, are we? No. Clavicus files, dog. Oh, oh, that's right. Pelagius. Why is the music so loud? I quickly this way. Oh, good choice. Well, good for me. I find everyone being out to get you so terribly entertaining. <laughs> you might find it less so. What yeah. makes you say you that? You see, Pelagius's mother was, well, let us say, unique. Although I suppose, in the grand scheme of things, she was fairly average for a septum. That woman wielded fear like a cleaver. Or did she wield a cleaver and make people afraid? I never get that part right. Oh, but she taught her son well. Pelagius learned at a very early age that danger could come from anywhere, at any time, delivered by anyone. The objective here is simple, you simpleton. Use your wabaja to defeat the enemy, but they do the same. Fair enough. What if I strike you? Oh, I got you never figure it out. With the threat gone, Pelagius is under the kind of randomly did that. that he's safe, which means you've helped him out, sort of. And we're that much closer to home. That was it. I truthfully had forgotten what I actually do here, so <laughs> it's kind of funny. I just. Decided that I would just do that. Alright. Alright, dude. I hope you're having a good time. Actually, I hope I'm having a good time. I could care less about you. That sounds about right. No more night terrors, no more paranoia. Ah, so now, my dear Pelagius can hate himself for being legitimately afraid of things that actually threaten his existence. But only during the day. Honestly, I can't keep up. But by all means, don't stop now! Okay, fine, I'll be back. Run your stupid errands. Now this is a sad path. Pelagius hated and feared many things. Assassins, wild dogs, the undead, pumpernickel. But the deepest, keenest hatred was for himself. The attacks he makes on himself can be seen here fully. They're always carried out on the weakest part of his fragile self. The self-loathing enhances Pelagius' anger. Ah, but his confidence will shrink with every hit. 
You must bring the two into balance. All right, if I remember right, I gotta make you bigger. First, I gotta make contact. Get out of the way, big guy. Little guy needs help. I killed him! Oh, there he is. Make you smaller. Never should have come here. Here we go. You never should have come here. As good as dead. Not the best you can do. Yeah. I don't remember the. You seem to be having a small problem. Or perhaps it's a big problem. Maybe if you shrunk the whole thing down this a little first. Will you fall down and bleed to death? Let's see, he just has to be bigger, doesn't he? I don't remember. Here we go. Here we go. This is a down and bleed to death. Nothing's happening whenever I hit the soldier version of him. Here we go. Here we go. Can I fight them? Take this. I don't remember what to do here. Why would I stop and look it up? Get bigger? Yeah, he can. Okay, done. that's what it was. Vegas is finally ready to love himself and continue hating everyone else. Hey, yeah. Later, big dude. I couldn't remember what to do there. Hey, yeah. All right, Shigorath. I'm not going to feel. What you have to like. Or something like that. I've done it. I've fixed Pelagius' mind. Hmm. Fixed is such a subjective term. I think treated is far more appropriate, don't you? Like sure. one does to a rash or an arrow in the face. <laughs> ah, but no matter. Heartless mortal that you are, you've actually succeeded and survived. Not really. I'm first to honor my end of the bargain. So... Congratulations! You're free to go. Bye! They've been known to change my mind. So, go. Really. I mean, don't... Pelagius don't Septum do you have to send me back? Once the mad emperor of Tamriel. Now so boringly sane. I always knew he had it in him. What happens if I hit Shay Gorath? I Shagorath? suppose it's back to the Shivering Isles. A trouble Haskell can get into while well, I'm gone simply boggles the mind. I gotta find out. Let's make sure I'm not forgetting anything. Clothes, check. Beard, check. Luggage. Luggage. Now where did I leave my luggage? Master, you've taken me back. Does this mean we're going home? Oh, I'm surprised you didn't do anything to me. I can't wait to. Yes, yes, that's quite enough. You're looking at. Let's send you ahead, shall we? As for you, a little mortal minion, feel free to keep the Waba Jack as a symbol of my. I'll just take the damn thing. You take care of yourself now. And if you ever find yourself up in New Sheo, do look me up. We can share a strawberry tart. Ha <laughs> ha! Ta ta! Sure. Lunatic. Send me out of here. I'm back, and I got some fancy clothes on. Not my armor that I had borrowed from those Thalmor. There's like a door to a room here. Am I crazy? 
This is where we ran and just randomly disappeared after he randomly made me naked for a second. Let's see. I don't remember if there's anything here I can take. Alright, I guess I'm out of here. I'm like five feet away from you. Calm down. Alright, now that that's don't done and over with. Way, but you look a little sickly. Why you people keep telling me I look gross? Can I talk to her? Oh, hello. She didn't Just do anything. Alright. Well, now that I've gotten that out of the way, I think I'm going to do the Convince Vittoria VC, Vici, VC, to release the spice wine shipment. So I'm going to go down to the docks. I haven't decided yet. I, I don't know if I'm going to do the Bard's College stuff while I'm here. I might, just because it would be useful for experience and whatnot. But, uh, yeah, that's a. Ooh, leaks! That's a possibility. I might do the Bard's College quests here shortly. Just to gain the extra experience. I need to make some vegetable stew now that I've got all these ingredients. Because I had, don't have any. And it is super handy. In fact, I'm going to wander around and see if I can find a cooking pot. Because I don't know if there's one out here that's accessible. But I think there is. Somewhere. Surely there's somewhere I could cook myself a meal. Hello, good sir. Do you have a place I can cook a meal? Surely he has something in here to cook on. He's got like a dang old whole house. But nowhere to cook. Ooh, right there. I was going to say, where do you guys prepare your food? Just a reminder for anyone new, if you didn't know in survival, you get tired and lose your endurance, and you get hung or you get hungry, lose your endurance, tired, lose your magicka, and your health doesn't regenerate on its own. And if you take vegetable stew, it re it has slow regeneration of health and it does a pretty decent amount of your hunger. You need cabbage, potatoes, leeks, tomatoes. And it is super handy to have at all times. Just for those that didn't know, I guess while I'm up here, I'll try and improve the sword that I have on me, and then I'll sell it to him. Okay, let's get to it. Hey, yeah. All right, horsey, we gotta go to the docks. Let's go. I don't remember if there's anything important to do with this quest, or if it's literally just like me paying a bill, because I feel like that's what it is. Can I make it down here without running off the edge with my horse? Sorry, small child, I'm running you over. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me. Yeah, this is very uh, sketchy trying to ride the horse down the dock. Keeps wanting to dart off to the right for some reason. I'm just gonna leave you right here. You talk to Ed Brothers. Deja has no words for you. You have no knowledge of who you speak to. Go. You're right. Okay, I'm going away. Hey, lady. Why can't I talk to you? You're too far away. All right, you're gonna make me come in there. Hmm? Some say I got my position because my cousin is the emperor. Nonsense. The man's given me nothing. He can't even be bothered to attend my wedding. I mean, he's dead now, so there's that. Of course, he's not gonna attend your wedding. Uh, Yvette San asked me to check her shipment of spices. Ah, yes. If she wants to pay the 2,000 gold tariff, then we'll be all set. Yvette can't afford the tariff. She can barely afford her stand. I suppose I could make an exception. Yes, you will. I do like her spice. You wine. will. Fine. Tell Yvette's son her shipment will be brought up to Solitude shortly. Damn right. That was easy. See all these little quests here? They're all like short and simple. I take care of the horses. Can you take care of my, my, take care of my horse? Words are hard. Ugh. And the garden. See, now I gotta get out of here without running nice. off the edge. You want them in your belly? No? Then you stop talking to me. No! Oh my god, I can't believe that worked. <laughs> it somehow didn't run off the ledge. And then I run off that ledge. Yeah, you gotta, uh, you gotta be, like, super delicate with the controls with the horse on this. Maybe it's my controller is super twitchy, I don't know. It feels like it wants to go all over the place. Okay, back up the hill. I'm running around doing everybody's errands for him, getting no experience. 
I hear a dragon somewhere in the distance, so I'm gonna get inside solitude real quick. Yep, there it is. Good luck, guys. Okay, fine. Hold on. Vegetable soup. Good thing I just made it. And then I need my ghost guy. Oak flesh. Ooh, he's good poison. Needle hide dragon? This is a new one. I don't know if Mark for Death will work on this dra on the dragons. Again, that's not gonna work because I just pissed off the solitude guard. I didn't think about that. That's a bad thing. I'm gonna reload the save that I just made. <laughs> Did I have any arrows? I don't have any arrows. I don't have any arrows. I can't help you guys. Also don't know where Janessa is. Can I get on the... No! Do not get on that the backside. He's trying to slap the shit out of me. Get behind him. Hiya! I'm in a good mood today. You guys in a good mood today? <laughs> It's the caffeine. I've had a bunch of caffeine lately, like in the last couple of hours. Get back down here! Don't face me! Face them! Slap you right in the butt! Hey, ah! Being Ghost Guy. Get him, Ghost Guy! And up in the air again. Not even a bow with dragons lifting off the ground. Can't see anything. Just, he just slapped the shit out of me. And I'm dead. You mother trucker. I knew better than to get right in front of it. I gotta remember to use my shouts. I've got to become ethereal, so in that situation I can escape. Keep forgetting. I gotta get in a position where I can't get bitten. Hey -ya! And the horse joins the party. Eternal slum awaits. Why does the sky look all green? Are we gonna have a tornado? You're going down. No. Again? Really? I wasn't even in front of him. I was like off to the side. Okay. Tip number three. Where are you going? What if it'll follow me if I go into into solitude? I'm gonna get an angle where I'm hitting it and not the guards if I use Mark for Death. Yeah, die, dragon. I missed. Pretty sure I missed. Don't get singled out. He's over here puking venom. Yeah. Where are you going, horse guy? Going the wrong way. Ooh. Right up the butt. Did it work? It worked. I'll just keep stunning him. This freaking tree is in my way. Stun him. You guys do the work and I'll try and keep it down. I lost sight. Lost sight. Smoke in the air. 
don't know if I hit it again. Be cool if that stuff stacked. I know he's spewing venom, but I wonder if my poisons will hurt him. Stamina poison, that's all I got. That feels worthless to me. Don't look at me. Focus on them. Did my ghost guy already go go down? I'm gonna use a flame atronox. Got some range. Holy crap. Stun him. Yeah. Just keep stunning with the shield. There's Janessa. Yeah, light him up. I'm like useless because I don't have any arrows. I mean, I guess I could try and use some magic. My magic skill is not not high though. No. Ah, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot to use my ethereal thing. I think we're switching to dual wield here. As soon as my magic returns. Forgot to take my soup. Got my soup. Just the dragon. He's glitching into the wall. Got to come around the backside. Whole crew here now. I'm curious if I go in that door, if that thing will fall off. No! I can't see through everything that's happening. I need my become ethereal shout. Stop taking damage. There goes Ghost Guy. him to help. Should I go into, into solitude and see what happens? Will it follow me? Okay, you're distracted. Hey, ah! I helped. Come down here and fight us, you coward. Can I hit it from here with Mark for Death? What if I jump? Didn't work. I also didn't jump like I meant to. <laughs> Glitching itself in the wall. I'm like afraid to get close. I'll slap the shit out of you with my shield. It's probably better just use become or have become ethereal on the trigger for exactly that reason. I gotta get away from that tail. You're doing great, guys. Just keep doing what you're doing.
Everybody's doing great. Proud of you. Go team. I gotta keep undercover. Cause I do not last. <laughs> yep. Just like that. If I get taken out again, I'm gonna run in solitude and see what happens, see what follows me. Where'd you go, big guy? It's like directly over us, there it is. Got all its puke all over the ground. Am I not hitting it? It's like I'm in its hitbox because I can't go forward. But it's acting like I'm not hitting it. I'll see you, bud. Charge! Hiya! I don't know if I'm doing any damage. Maybe I am. Can't tell. He's all bloody, though. You're gonna spew his crap everywhere. I thought he was going to fire it at me. It doesn't last very long, but it lasts long enough. Long enough to get myself out of a sticky situation. You gonna land? You guys were not supposed to like put me in between you. I'm Dragonborn, but I am very, very fragile. So fragile. Bro, we've been fighting this thing for like 12 in-game hours. It was daylight, now it's freaking Aurora Borealis nighttime. It looked like he was looking at me. That ugly mug. Go around the backside. I'll take out the left flank. Hey ya! Wata! Got him, guys! Come on! Judo! 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 Man, it's just sitting here taking it. You are mine! Game's glitching out. I never would have believed it if I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. What that I'm Dragonborn? Heard they were forming a Dawn Guard. Vampire. Did them? The old fort near Well you you got bored with the dragon real quick, didn't you? Wasn't that neat? Nobody cares? Okay. <gasps> Forty four arrows? Take it all. And I'm carrying too much. Janessa. We're one of the Thanks for carrying my burdens. Let's go inside. I wonder where my horse went. 
I just realized the horse ran off and <laughs> never came back. Hope it's out there. At least that dragon conveniently showed up when there were a bunch of soldiers around. All the help I can get is uh, useful. Since I am delicate and fragile. Is she at home? Am I going to get in trouble if I go to her house and go inside? The door's probably locked, actually. Probably going to have to wait till morning. Oh, that's the end. Hello? Anybody home? It's only 9 o'clock, I guess. You don't look so good. Are you feeling all right? People keep telling me that. Wanderer like you needs a little fire in the veins. Some spiced wine? The East Empire Company is sending up your spices. Thank you so much. I swear it's a fight with them every shipment. Here's something for your troubles. Hey, thanks. How are your sales? They're adequate. Honestly, I rely on the business brought in by the burning of King Olaf. And that's not likely to happen this year. The burning of King Olaf? Well, it's a great big festival put on by the bards every year. They burn an effigy of old King Olaf. It's quite a bit of fun. The bards give out spiced wine during the festival, so they put it in a big order. And then, for weeks after, demand is so high, I can barely keep up. But with the death of High King Torig, the festival has been declared in poor taste. So it looks like it won't happen this year. So you're telling me if I... Good luck out there. It seems like a tough time to be wandering Skyrim. Get the Bard's College to put on their festival. I'll help you make money. Now here's a woman I'm glad to see. I'll do it. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do the Bard's College stuff. We'll help her out. But for now... Well, look at that sky. She wish you could see that all the time in real life. I know some people in certain parts of the world can, but I can't where I'm at. In the middle of a uh, light pollu polluted city. So, anyway, that seems like a good place to call it for this video. So if you like this video, give me a like. Give me a comment if you have something you want to say. And, uh, yeah, I guess I will catch you guys next time. I guess I'm going to go ahead and go to the Bard's College and start that quest. That'll give me a Pretty sure that's a couple of different quests that I have to go through. Let's see here. Speak to Viarmo at the Bard's College. Pretty sure that gives me a couple of different. Didn't trigger it. That was weird. It was like highlighted and then not highlighted. Pretty sure it gives me a couple of different quests to go to because I have to run a couple different places and get artifacts or books or something. I don't remember for them. I'm already right here. So yeah. Leave me a like. Thanks for going on the uh, adventure with me. Drop me a comment. You know, if you feel the need. No pressure. But I appreciate you guys, appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. Thank you very much. Adios. Have a good night. Bye-bye.